Hello and welcome, folks, to a- another week of Get Even. I am your host, Yarwolf Games. Uh, so it's it's been a couple weeks. Uh, the first week I had done some overtime and I was just extremely tired. This last week it was raining and hailing like crazy, and I just couldn't hear. Um, much less know that, or much less I knew that you guys wouldn't have been able to hear me or the game. It was it was loud. Uh, it, on, it only ended up lasting like probably a half hour, 45 minutes or so, but by that point the stream would have been, what, an hour and a half, hour and 15? So, and I didn't know how long it was going to go for, so I didn't want to leave people waiting just to see if I was going to pop up. So I just went ahead and canceled it. But, um... I've got my very shetty co-host, Wesker here, kind of, he's, he's just below everything, oh, there, there's his tail, yeah, fantastic. And let's see if he can go without licking my hand. No, no, not even, not even ten seconds, not even ten seconds into the stream, and, uh, you had to get right to it. So yeah, we are going to be getting back into Get Even. I can't remember where I left off either, so that should be interesting. And then I have to remember controls. Should be even more interesting. Wesker, you've got so much hair just falling off of you. I need to get a cat brush or something. Uh, was it Tab? Yes. Tab. And then I can go through all that stuff. I have a new text. Black, where are you? You promised to help me. Oh. Yeah, that's probably not good. Uh, how do I... Z. T. Q. E. Uh, C. Um, tab. No. Um, well, maybe I just don't have the, my gun right now. Oh, that's beautiful. Jesus, man. Get your hands off. There's only for any of this. Shut up. Move. <laughs> ah, lovely. So I imagine he was moving this way since we have nowhere else to go anyways. Uh, I really... Oh, oh, I can switch through them just by hitting the uh, middle mouse button. Interesting. Okay. F. Oh, it's this room again where she blew up. Wait. I know this place. This is where the explosion happened. Ah, yes. Your mind is preoccupied with the explosion, Mr. Black. The Pandora can only process what your brain Ow. <laughs> Concentrate only on the memory. Asshole. I am trying. And try harder. No! Chief. Glad to be aboard. Not a hair on her head. Who are you? Trust me. You brought me here. Fuck you. Oh, lovely. Red? Hey, Red! What the hell is this? None of this makes any sense! You are here because Thanks for getting a bunch of hair on my this face. Man and the explosion. The Pandora is trying to decode the messages your mind is sending. Oh, shit. Focus. It's your fault, it's your fault, it's your fault. Obviously. I'm focusing! Uh, what if I get through here? Oh, what is that? That's it. The Pandora okay. unit is offering you a pathway deeper into your memory. Pursue this. Interesting. Yeah, let's pursue the memory. PHC 2006. Dude, so much air. Jesus. <clears throat> hey, Wesker. Thank you for not being immensely annoying. That's 
very much appreciated. Remember, Mr. Black, human memory is unreliable at the best of times. I need you to work with my technology, not against it. Take uh, in your surroundings and get as much information as you can. Yeah, sure. Oh. Not a problem. Uh, can we talk about this? What's up? Don't you bite my chin. You are almost a sweet cat. But you're kind of an asshole. Alright. Uh, I don't know. Is there anything on the wall? Oh, I see. Haha. -ha. Uh Hey, how do I crouch again? <laughs> Control, that's right. Yeah, you're a good cat. What of it? Uh, okay. Control, get back up. Please don't bite my arm. I don't know why we have to have this conversation, but please don't do it. Police crime scene detected. Multiple homicide. Attending officers Fair and Chadwick. Oh yeah, Fair and Chadwick. Oh, that's right, the, the weird murder that happened. Multiple homicide. No IDs. I will warn you, like, oh, hey, don't need my leg. Don't there. need... Ah. Well, Donald, hey! How's it going? Don't mind me twitching. That's just my cat dragging his... Okay. Okay. That's enough. Once you start digging your claws in, we are no longer friends. <laughs> uh, I just sat on my computer uh, out of the monkey suit. Ah, uh, this is get even. Yes, it is. Get even is really, really good. What the hell's going on with this door? That's weird. Can I go in here? No, I can't. Wait, you just sat on your computer? You should probably not do that. That's that's a very bad I thing to do. Idea. I mean, that usually breaks computers. Aha! So Get Even is a really, really good game. Um, I really like this phone, and I want it. Think of your cat's claws as a difficulty multiplier or modifier. Yeah, but it feels so good on your bum. <laughs> Computer bum. Does that mean that your uh, bum is smarter now? Wait, who's cop one and who's cop two? Okay, fine. Uh, wait, what about evidence three? Do we not to? Oh, okay. Wait, no, 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 hold on. That's evidence one, where the hell is two? Don't play this crap with me. Oh, there's two. We're gonna go in order. Ah, jeez. Wait, no evidence found. And then two just disappeared, fine. What about three? Whoa, why is everyone made out of flies? Uh, I think they're made out of data, because basically what you're doing is you're going into your own memories in this game, and uh, trying to figure out who the hell you are. Well, you supposedly know who you are, but I'm pretty sure you don't actually know. Um, and you're trying to figure out why the hell you're here, because you're basically being held captive by this guy that talks to you every now and again. Oh, hey, look at that. Well, roll his body over. Oh, look at that. oh hi. Entire face. There goes any dental mesh. Oh yeah, if his entire face is gone, there's not much we can do. 
professional job. Ah. Huh. This many stiffs and no idea. We could link this to a hundred cases. All the cases. So, uh, drug dealer is then. What do you reckon? Adam's family or one of my turners lot? Uh, well, don't worry. Decide later. Get the uniforms to bag it all. I'm getting a little peckish. There's that new calf opened up next to the neck. You fancy it? Yay! Oh, hi. What is this? You are trying to process too much, Mr. Black. The Pandora cannot keep up. Concentrate only on the man you came here to find. Oh. Hi. There, Mr. Black, right there. Use your scanner. Identify and consolidate your memory. Who is that man? The Pandora will do the rest. Ah, uh, well. What, what the hell do you want me to do? Or is that my man? Is this my guy? Who's my guy? Oh, hi. Identification confirmed. Jasper Prado. <gasps> Status deceased. There is me thinking we can uh -oh. talk this out like that. <laughs> if you want to do it, then at least look me in the fucking eye. Agreed. So we have a name then. Jasper Prado. Interesting. Boy, here's the keys. You're driving. Oh, come on, Sheep. Why have I always got to drive? Rags, son. <laughs> Rags. What now? Oh. How do I know this? You don't. The Pandora is cross referencing your memory with any police files, files in the database. This memory is breaking down. You must move on. Okay. Blood test analysis came this morning. The victim's DNA matches the DNA we found on the blast site. Chadwick claims that the same location was previously used by local junkies, so Prado, as a drug addict and a dealer, wasn't necessarily involved in the kidnapping. Okay. Um, shooting victim identified. Uh... Jasper Prado, yeah, we know that. Uh, known mercenary, ex-military man. Oh, okay. Uh, still unknown if Prado was the only victim. Didn't they have several victims that they were looking at, like, on the scene? Look at this. I mean, how do they not know if he's the only one? Ballistic analysis... Examination of both crime, crime scenes, Bruce Grove, Brooms Grove, kidnapping, Jasper Prado case, as well as collecting and analyzing the physical evidence related to weapons and ammunition during both criminal investigations leads to the conclusion that the shooters used weapons produced by ADS. Uh-oh. ADS is, like, behind all of this crap. It's gotta be. So where do you want me to... Well, I guess this is the only door. Uh, okay. Oh, I guess I can't go through there. Oh, there's blood. Hi, blood! Whoa. Help. Agreed. I think that was the, the chick that blew up in the beginning. This place again. Yes. Your mind is definitely throwing up some kind of link between this Jasper Prado and the explosion. Huh. I'm surprised it's this pronounced, though. As if something is bothering you. Something is bothering me. Who is Jasper? Comes from working class family. Father was a truck driver. Mother worked in a pub. Bright kid in school, though quickly lost all interest in eh, blah 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 education and started looking for fun elsewhere. Mostly partying in nightclubs and smoking pot with friends. Oh hey, good plans. Good plan. Whoa. Anything else hanging around? Oh, there's one. Uh, he was in the army 1994 to 96, then started working as a mercenary. Really? So, so he worked in the army for two years. 
two years, okay. And then immediately went and became a mercenary. I don't think his resume actually pans out. But works as a mercenary and a drug dealer. After being discharged, these days he makes most of his money dealing hash, pot, and ecstasy. But still keeps in touch with old friends. Oh, that's so sweet. Too late. Well, that's mean. I know I was too late to save her. I didn't know what button to press. Alright. that you've engaged with an earlier point in the memory. And we still don't know why you're here. I was here to stop Jasper getting killed, I'm sure. Careful, Black. You're dealing with raw theory. Pay attention to the facts only. You risk imminent corruption if you continue this course. Fuck you, Red. Huh. I know why I'm here. Yeah. Oh, hey. Well, there's Jasper, it looks like. What's over there? Yeah, let's go see what... Hmm. Whoa! Hi. That's a doll. Yeah, I definitely heard gunshots. Well, I heard loud bangs. I guess they were gunshots, because the guy was shot, right? Anyway, I was out Good deduction. Cujo, my dog, at around five Cujo? Eight. Yay! My wife's a heavy sleeper. And Cujo's always sleeping nope. shit in the morning. Oh, yeah, sometimes we'll take him out for a walk. So, yeah, I, I was walking down Palm House Lane and into the fields when the shots were fired. Huh. Okay. What do we got here? Incident report. Jacob Singer. Former Jared Porter. Hey, Ash. Thanks for the ten bits and welcome. We're just playing some uh, Get Even. Trying to figure out why the hell... Uh, Black is so confused and why he has to confuse us along the way. Uh, claims the weapons he was arrested. And you did a little bit of damage to uh, Weeping up there, because Weeping took over as the uh, stream boss. So, good job. Uh, with the help of ADS employee called J. Jasper Prado. Uh, Porter doesn't know the person's full name. Seems like Porter, a big name in the local arms trafficking business, worked in close cooperation with big and esteemed arms contractors. Woot! Woot indeed! Bart Fair! Alrighty. Wait, so the, the officer's name is Bart Fair? Okay. I thought we were just going to a Bart Fair. I don't know what kind of fair that could be. Maybe a fair full of Bart. Are you Bart? What are you interrogating a mannequin? Good job. Alrighty. Now let's see if we can thanks for the slip of a little hand in my Wow, Ash, thanks. Another 70 bits from you. That is so appreciated. And you did a good chunk of damage. Holy crap. Thank you so much. What? I, I heard a phone ringing. Can we talk about the phone right quick? Oh, it must be part of the, the ambiance, if you will. Where the hell are you now? I hear you. Yes. Oh, they're all over the place, maybe. Hurry. You hurry. I'm just trying to find memories. And I can't jump. Hurry. Huh. Okay, let's, uh, let's go forward, then. Hurry. Interesting. Oh, hey. What's your problem? I won't tell Nothing. you who I am. You need to back the fuck away now. This is out of your hands, and there's nothing you can do about it. So leave me the fuck alone, and just let this run its course. Okay. I will. I will get... I'll get right on it. 
Yeah, they, he just sits there and says hurry and then tells me to back the fuck up. Like, that's so rude. It's so rude. What did I do to you? Oh, there is a memory right here. Oh, hi. Anything else I should be aware of besides these two notes? Homicide, case file. Bart Fair, Hector Chadwick. Case closed. They just closed it. They were like, ah, whatever. Uh, Detective Bart Fair missing. 45-year-old Detective Bart Fair has been reported missing following a four-day period where he failed to report for work and his wife, Jenny Fair, was unable to contact him. The Chronicle was able to contact Fair's workmate, Hector Chadwick, who has taken unpaid leave in order to help find his friend. That sounds suspicious. He's a great copper, Bart, but he always got far too involved with his work. A man should never put his career first, especially when he has a family. I'll find him. He'll be fine. Detective Fair was recipient of the Severn Police Bravery, Bravery Award in 2009 following his famous rugby tackle of a knife-wielding maniac at Birmingham Moore Street Station. Unicorn! R2 unit! Gasp! How are you? How's the kiddo? Kiddo's gotta be great, right? Oh, so can't wait to meet him. Oh. Is there anything else outside? No? Okay. Oh, I can't, I can't even go in there. Interesting. Can I go in here? Yes, I can. That sounded weird. Yay! Glad to hear it. Black, I've been reviewing the data. Your disregard of protocol, pursuit of supposition, and lack of gathered evidence has rendered this investigation useless. I'm pulling you out. No, Fuck you, dude. Not yet. Nope. I'm so close. I can do this. You leave me alone. I want to know what happened. Oh, jeez. It's falling apart. Oh, okay. Ooh. Can't go through there. Uh, so how's everybody doing? Doing today? Pulling you out? Uh, well, I guess that's the end of the game then. It was a nice stream while it lasted. Yes, that's just how the game ends. No sequel, nothing. Just, it's done. Oh, hi. Oh, that's a fucking problem. How do I, how do I, fuck, I can't remember how to switch weapons. Two. There we go. Ah, got it. Ah, oh, I can't... Yay! I could shoot through there. It was just moving really, really slow. <laughs> uh, okay, fantastic. Whoa! Hi! Oh! Well, first death of the stream. Ash! Hitting me with another 20 bits? You're awesome. Like I said, Thank you so much. Making assumptions. <laughs> the Pandora is neutral black, and so must you be. Maybe you really were there to save Jasper. But the moment you assume that to be true, you corrupt the simulation and cast doubt over the Wait, memory. so that was that not a death? If you continue to do so, we will not be able to proceed. Maybe I don't want to proceed. Oh, I think you do, Mr. Black. You wouldn't be here if you didn't want answers. Unicorn that makes all of us. That doesn't know what's happening right now. <laughs> um... Okay, so what I know so far is Red, the guy talking to you, Black, um, is basically holding you prisoner and trying to make you delve into your own mind to find some specific, uh, specific memory. Um, Let's try a different approach this time, Black. Different how? I'd like to try starting before Prado was killed. You want me to try again? 
to save Jasmine. I don't want you to try anything, Mr. Black. Everything is prepared for you. Just relax and explore. Yeah, sure. Fantastic. Um, <clears throat> so this Jared Prado or whatever um, is somebody that I don't even quite understand. He was he was a arms dealer basically, or no, a uh, mercenary and a drug dealer. Um, and that's a lot of all I know. This is a really, really confusing game, but so far it's been really good. Um, is that what you want me to dive into? That can't be what you want me to dive into. That can't be right. Oh, look at my gun. That's cool. Hey, more uh, notes and stuff. It's me. You need to tell me where the fuck you are and what the fuck is going on. You got a lot to answer for. You know that. Basically, Inception, the video game. You are not wrong. <laughs> uh, uh, okay, Jasper Prado, victim or culprit? First, it was the corpse, a dead body found in the warehouse near Route Ten. Now, for the first time, we investigate who he really was. Uh, found near Route 10, then we learned the victim's name was Jasper Prado. Now, for the first time, we investigate who he really was. The victim of a psycho... Uh, wait, what? Okay. Uh, an innocent man who was the victim of a psychopath or a cold-hearted criminal who got what was coming to him. Since being dis... It's so weird to have the article laid out like this. They... Like, generally, they'll have a picture in the middle, but it's not exactly laid out where you're going to read. I don't know, it just doesn't quite happen like that anymore. Since being discharged from the military over a decade, decade ago, Prado returned to the county or country where he immediately began contributing to what would become a substantial criminal record. Just four months before his death, he was arrested for drug possession. Was his death drug related? Or did his lifestyle become too much to handle? The police have yet to officially rule out suicide. After Prado took a bullet to the back. That's how I figured it happened. Or wait, no, didn't he take a bullet like straight to the face? And I mean, we already figured out that Prado had his fingertip, like his fingertips were shot off. And his whole entire face was destroyed, like to a point where they couldn't get dental records. How would they even jump to suicide with that? Corpse of a man in his 30s was found in an abandoned warehouse this week, yet nobody has the slightest clue regarding the victim's true identity. Uh, appears the victim was shot from close distance. Uh, we've yet to establish how long it was there. Autopsy scheduled for Friday. And bloody 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 blah. Let's go. Oh god. Uh, shell. The place is known as the Shell. Abandoned warehouse. Uh, one local myth suggests it gets its name from the numerous shell casings found in the warehouse over the years. The place certainly looks like it witnessed its fair share of killing. Awesome. Uh, Prado Jasper. Anything? Oh, everything's redacted. Fantastic. Letter of appreciation. Uh, Lieutenant Prado, really? Really? Okay. You and the other members of your division did an outstanding job of securing the forward position, setting up and establishing communications, and coordinating the movement of follow-on forces. Without your dedication to duty, Operation Grapple would not have been the success that it was. Congratulations on the job well done. Your face is redacted. Thank you! Uh, also, this is a good example of the military giving out awards and commendation for fucking anything. Like, literally, the military gives out participation trophies. It is a thing there. It's, uh, it was, there's so many words. So, so many words. Mm, talk to Ben and Eric, thought it made perfectly clear the bad apple needs to be removed as soon as possible. We can't take the risk. Uh, malware's punch? That's probably not the right place to send that to. Malware, bad. Secure need needle in the hay. Huh. 
Like I said on the phone, this is delicate. You work for me and follow my orders. If you can't handle that, I find somebody else. No mucking about. Well, I'm about to muck about. So does that mean this is where we're supposed to go? Into this memory? Yeah. So what did I do wrong last time? You just lost your way, Black. That's all. My reading suggests the majority of that memory remains unexplored. Focus this time. Assume nothing. Explore the memory in full. <laughs> Relax and explore. Very good, Mr. Black. He ain't lying. I got a combat action badge for a mortar round landing on the fob and wounding two contractors. Everyone on that fob that day got a cap. I absolutely believe it. I do. <laughs> I am gonna muck about. This is exactly the same memory as the last one, just a little earlier on. We need a clearer understanding of exactly what happened. Understood. This memory is a little temperamental, Mr. Black. I would advise it's against going in guns blazing. Try not to get spotted. Right. Ah, uh, now I have to remember how to cycle the uh, gun. Trust me. Trust me, it'll make sense when I figure it out. I'm just going to press buttons for a second. Oh. Obviously the wrong button. No. Yes. Ah, uh, crap. Was it tab? No. Shift. Control. No. Z. No. Four. F three. No. Oh shit. Uh, go back to two. Don't mind me, just muck it about. Uh, what the fuck was it? I, I can't remember. I literally cannot remember. Uh, there, no. Okay, so the reason I'm trying to do this is there's a thing you can do with this weapon to make it like wind around corners it's it's really fucking cool and <laughs> I I want to do it because if I can't do it then I have to expose myself oh god <laughs> now I know you all want me to be able to find it out because uh... nobody wants me to have to expose myself <laughs> uh, okay Space. This button. This button. These buttons. Numbers. Any buttons. Q. Oh! Oh, if you're not aiming in. I got it. Okay. Okay, so I had the right buttons. I just wasn't supposed to be aiming down the sights like that. Uh... No. Wait, what do we have here? Is that a... That is a guy. Here. Let me see if I can... Uh, get him. Ow. Well, I couldn't... Uh, I couldn't get him in time. Damn it. Poke your head out again. Did you hear what I said? I need you to work with me, Mr. Black. Against what do you mean? I'm just having fun just with the gun. <laughs> okay. What? Wait, wait, wait. Oh, uh, okay. This should be good. Ooh, what's in here? Oh, hey. Wesley... Two feet. A heel. And Jasper. Fair enough. 
But now we know what Jasper looked like while he was still in the military. So I killed these two guys. I wonder if that means that there is a participation trophy in my future. Oh. Okay. Where do I need to go? This isn't funny. Okay, so I came from over here. Over that way. And now I'm totally 100% confused. Ooh. Can I can I climb this? No. Can I can I do anything? <laughs> is there is there an option for do anything? Uh, oh, can I open this? Please? Any? Oh my god, you guys suck. <laughs> oh wait, maybe there is a wall that I can climb? Like a break in a wall? That'd be cool. I could totally pick myself up and climb over that. What are the blinking dots we have here? Am I supposed to... No. No. Not right. That was wrong. Can I, can I move him out of the way? Well, folks, this has been fun. I have obviously uh, got lost, so uh, that's the that's the end of the stream. I hope you all have a wonderful week, uh, the rest of it at least, and I will see you next time. I'm kidding. I'm absolutely kidding. But I do get lost so much, I wouldn't be surprised if everybody ran out of here screaming. Where in the fuck am I supposed to go? There's got to be something else in here that I just did not see. Nope. That's a negative. Hey, Red. <laughs> you want to give me a hint? Oh. See, we have something here. But why is it showing anything? I missed the part where you picked up that weapon. Is that uh, a rifle-shaped camera holder with a silencer equipped uh, pistol affixed to the front? Yes! And this is um, kind of odd. It looks more like a FAMAS. Almost. Well, no. Now that we can kind of see the side of it. <laughs> AR556. So we know it shoots some 556. Um, so we're going to go ahead and assume M4. Since that's what they throw into most games anyways. Uh, okay. What if I press Alt? Uh, okay. What if I press this button? Ooh, did I see footprints? Oh, no, I saw a gun. Why is it manufactured in Iran, was it? Oh, no shit. Huh. That's really weird. I don't know. Uh, oh. Hey, can we talk about this? What what is up with that? 
Uh, can I shoot it? Oh no no no! I need to I need to I need to scan it. Yeah, figured it out. Yay! the memory. Stop shooting, Mr. Black. Time is against us. But, you know, if they die, that means that I have less that I have to actually deal with, so... Wheels are in motion. Wheels usually are in motion. I mean, unless you have the vehicle stop, then, then I guess they're not in motion, but shit. Uh... Let's go around this way. Ha ha. He'll never find me over here. No, you didn't. Fuck off with that. You didn't see anything. Oh, hell. He almost rounded that corner. Okay. Uh, here's to hoping I can follow him. Let's go through the bushes. Yeah. No. Come on. Come on, I know it's got to be there. Shit! Uh, I've got to shoot some more guys. So, there's that. Wait, what? Oh. Huh. Why did that need to be there? Got him, guys. This way. Yeah, you're a liar. Liar. <laughs> yeah, Unicorn, he, he definitely saw me. Um, they're just too stupid to round the corner, I guess. Uh, okay. Let's get back to the map and see if there's any more blue blinky things. Oh, they're all over there. Can I go in the building over here? Yay! Okay. Good news. Uh, I think that something is wrong with this memory again. It's becoming highly unstable. I will try to fix it. In the meantime, I'm sending you a picture. I need you to use it to exit. Are you? Why are you... Why are you sending me a picture? Here's a better question. Where are you sent... Oh, there it is. Alright. He needs to chill with the heavy breathing. If they don't see you, they'll hear you. <laughs> uh... Alrighty, so I'm in here now. Again, aren't I? But what were these? Weapons, Mr. Black. A personal armory, if you will. I thought you said I shouldn't kill. Something about distorting memories. The more evidence you uncover, the less yeah, we risk the... distortion. You're saying that I need to collect all the evidence for each board. That's up to you, Mr. Black. But if you do, the memories become more stable, which means I can reward you with a new toy every now and then. Yay! Reward me with toys. I like toys, especially when they shoot bullets. Okay. Now I guess I'm supposed to go back in? Okay, so that whole room right there, uh, and why I didn't pay much attention to it, 
is it's basically uh, a synopsis of everything I've way. done so far, Proceed. and then you can like go back over. Um, it's kind of like a, a a way to do a in-game chapter select, so to say. Oh hi! Stop breathing, dude. Just like calm the fuck down. Ooh, they are all over the place. Ooh. Oh, oh, he's coming this way. Oh. This is problematic. Um... He is breathing so heavy right now. Hey, you're in the army, right? Sure was. I'm going to ask you a question. Hello? You didn't see shit. Did you, um, did you ever kill a guy? Yeah, I did. What was it like? Fucking horrible. Why did you sign up here then? It's. It's all I know. Heavy. What do you mean, no evidence found? There we are. Where are they seeing me from? Is there people above me? Damn it. Oh, hi. Well, that's not good. I am, uh, I, I'm not a very stealthy individual. <laughs> Nowhere. Nowhere to be seen. Nowhere. Oh, lovely. Let's, uh, let's switch it up. They want to go loud, let's go loud. Wait. Oh, no. Oh, no. No, why'd I do that? Why'd I switch up? Don't switch up. There we go. Okay. There we are. Whew! Melee, melee. I can't. There, there's literally no button for melee. Otherwise, I would. He can't have just disappeared. Oh hi. Well, that didn't feel good. Oh, dang it! Clobber him with the tripod. Yes. That seems to have stabilized. Proceed. Uh, thank you. Uh, well, that, that was weird. So I died, but it's stabilized. Huh, weird. Let's, uh, let's go upstairs. Yeah. They probably pinpointed your location by your breathing? Yeah, probably. Like, down to a science, they freaking, they were like, yeah, he is definitely breathing. Go the other way. There you go. Oh, there, there is a guy up top. 
I see. Oh god, oh god, calm down. Excuse me? Why did silence in video games have to get so realistic? Fuck all of you. <laughs> Jared Porter. Rest records. Traffic. Class C drug possession. Possession of explosives. Wait, 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 wait a second. Possession of explosive in a suspicious circumstance. Okay. <laughs> Fair enough. Oh god, I can't get out of it. Uh, ben called me saying we're all. F uh, wait, we're all fucked pigs. Uh, oh, we're all fucked. Pigs got Jared, and it's only a matter of time they get the rest of us. Jared came to me saying nothing about being arrested, acting like nothing happened. When I told him what Ben had told me, he said Ben was just tripping. No pigs were on to him, and he just went to London for the day. I'm fucking positive that something's off, and if pigs have Jared on their leash, we can't trust him anymore. Is there any circumstance you can possess explosives and it's not suspicious? Um, I was thinking about it, like, as as I read that, and literally the only explosive I can think of is a firework. That's it. Hi! Hey! Hear me out, please! Just... just hear me out! Sure! You hear me just for you? I've got him back there. And why are you here? They locked me up because I was helping him out, but I only did it out of fear, I swear. I've seen him kill people just for disagreeing with him. Yeah. Please, please, if you leave me here, they'll kill me. No, you know what? <laughs> Fuck you. The last person I helped out tried to kill me. Yep. Yep. We are leaving him be. Yeah, you're damn right I'm leaving him because the last, like I said, the last person I fucking saved and let out of his cell fucking tried to kill me. Jasper's been working under the radar for almost a decade, was in the army in the 90s where he first made contact with people who now provide him work as a mercenary, got discharged, likes his recreational narcotics, pot, uh, what is that? Cat? Here, hold on. Z. Cat? What the hell is cat? Does anybody know what drug cat is? And ecstasy. Um, makes some money selling it on the side, tends to deal in small amounts to keep a low profile. Unpredictable and erratic, but the best merc I knew. See, I don't does drugs, so I, I I couldn't tell you what the hell that's supposed to be. Huh. Yay. Oh, hi. Interesting. Uh... Oh, hey, there's a phone here. Jasper, he knows, and he's coming for you. Meet me at the mansion. I'm on my way, Rose. Hmm. Rose Atkins. Who's Rose Atkins? No memory of Jasper. Found his phone, though. Oh. Shit's getting weird. He brought me out, Red. There's no... 
insane. I can, I can think this time. Red, did you see that? We've got a name and a place. Rose and a mansion. Woo! Red. Red? Are you there? Red! Too busy to answer my calls. We need to give him the memory stick and cash in. Thought you'd be happy. It's almost over. Interesting. I'm pretty sure you're hooked up to a machine. Weird place to wake up. Red. Hey. Or no, you, you are watching? hooked up to a machine. Who's Rose? And where is this mansion? Red. We still haven't finished our investigation into this. Casper business, Mr. Black. What do you mean, haven't finished? We've got a name, a place. Jasper's dead. We need to... I will say what we need to do, Black. You are here at my convenience. I think that's Rose. My technology. Do not fucking trust me. Nobody trusts me. Okay. Okay, fine. Then what do I do? Red, I said what do I do? Oh, never mind. I'll just proceed, shall I? Yeah. Follow along. Alrighty. Ah, uh, what do we have back here? Just the light. Fair enough. Oh, no, no. I wanna, can I, can I switch to the phone? Yes. New memoir. Yay, so many memories. So many fantastic memories. Meth Canada? Wait, what? Poor man's Coke. Thanks, Google. All right, cocaine. Poor man's Coke. Got it. Ooh, what do we have here? Art therapy session. Fantastic. Every Monday and Friday at 4 p.m. in Building C. All patients are welcome. Ooh, I want some art therapy. I wonder if I'm even going the right way. Ooh, hey, recorder. Why did you do that? What? I don't know. Why, Why did, did you, you do that? Paint your prosthetic leg black. It's depressing. No, it's not. Yes, it is. Oh, and I was hoping you're cured. I am cured. Your leg was sick. Remember? That's why I had to cut it off. I know you loved it, but sometimes we have to let go of the things we love the most. <laughs> How's the other leg? She's fine. Bit sad, maybe. Her sister was amputated. They were twins. Mm, I see. Creepy. Maybe they should be together. Yeah, all right. I'll think about it. All right. Cut everybody's legs off. It's going to be great. Oh, hi. Mannequin? Oh, yeah. How about that? Uh, inmates, I've met, talk a great deal about war. We all have flashbacks of the things we've seen, the things we've done. When I first woke up in my cell, I thought this must be kind of some kind of military experiment. Making soldiers face their traumas. So is the puppet master our commander in chief, or are we all ca captives of our greatest enemy, Donkey Kong? Donkey Kong has returned to take over and investigate. Patient 8-03 recently suffered from losing a loved one. His partner was killed during a shooting. Previous therapies didn't work for him, so I think we should try art therapy now. Yeah. Agreed. Wait. I have a new text. I want to see it. Art therapy. It sure has helped me. I painted you getting... Wait. No. Give me back that one getting fucking killed over and over again. He was just trying to make ends meet, guarding a goddamn car park. I'm in the bathroom, I'll be right there. That's the last text I got from him. I had waited for six hours until somebody found his body. Okay. Sure hope I'm going the right way. Oh, I must be, that door just closed on me. Oh, hi. Yeah. 
All right. Random psychopath. <clears throat> Puppet Master loves both art and artists, but his art is bigger than life. All the people, their plans and dreams hang as if by string of string over darkness he chooses who will be saved and who will fall donkey kong hmm. fair enough i just want everybody to know that i will never not refer to those initials as anything other than donkey kong so yeah so that's the thing you're just all gonna have to accept oh hey i'm outside Excuse the fuck out of me? Red, how are you doing this? I'm not Mr. Black. You are. An imprecision of the technology. Sometimes, Sometimes the Pandora will overlay images onto reality. I don't understand. You don't need to. You're in very real danger from your own mind. Ooh. Proceed with caution. Yeah. Okay. My heart just sank. I'm very. What the fuck? How is that even freaked possible? Out. Freaked out. Oh. Hello. I don't know where I'm going. I'm gonna assume that I have to go towards that light. Oh. That's not good. Uh, Q? Ah! I'll just, uh, I'll be right here. I'll be right here, just fearing for my life, if that's cool. Oh, God. Nope, nope. Mm. Get around the corner. He is holding that pistol very wrong. Yes, he is. Yes, yes, he is. Oh, move, move, move. Oh, no. I can't get into the bushes. I can't get into the bushes. fun forgetting that you have a gun when these things are really creepy. There's something about glowing red eye mannequins that just makes things very unsettling. Oh, hi. Oh, okay. Fantastic. You do what you're gonna do and I'll not get where I need to be. Oh god, where do I need to be? Uh, shit. Um, okay. Maybe my map can tell me. Oh, that's not good. That's not good. That's better. Maybe I just need to kill them all. They are really creepy mannequins. Wait, what is that? Ooh, what do we have here? Oh, that didn't work. That did nothing. I was hoping it would do something, but it didn't. Alright. We're going to assume that I need to run around and kill some mannequins. That's, that's how we're going to do this. Until I find a better option, mannequin killing.
Ah, oh, don't move. Whew. Okay. Do we have any others that I should know about? Okay. I killed the mannequins. What else do you want from me? Okay, so I can't go back that way. The mannequins are dead. Oh, maybe I just needed to scan this. Uh, okay. I definitely don't do enough with my scanner or anything. Uh, hello, where am I supposed to go? So there's a random light over there. It's really weird how random the light is. Because the way it's set up, it makes it seem like a, uh, like an objective. Maybe this is what I'm supposed to do? You confuse me. Uh, okay. Now can I go in? Now is it an option? Ah, how about that? Apologies, Mr. Black. Weird. The Pandora can be temperamental. I assure you that all anomalies have now been dealt with. From my end. For now. Yeah, I'm getting tired of temperamental. We are dealing with a prototype, Mr. Black. View it as fascinating. <laughs> so tired. Yeah, easy for you to say. You're not the one getting shot. I did you, did you didn't get shot, though, Black. You're, you're fine. That's pretty. Hmm. Pretty fucking gross. Uh, what do we got here? Okay. Yeah, I, I, okay, I suppose it's kind of artistic. In a sick, very maniacal kind of way. Um, but that's okay. That, that's okay. Oh, wait. Was there a piece of evidence back this way? This way, I suppose. Like I said, Mr. Oh. Black, all actions have consequences. You set a lunatic on the loose, and just look what happened. Poor Mr. Keating died because of your decisions. Ah, oh, poor Keating. And it was my fault, I guess. John Keating, a teacher and reported missing in 2011. Would he have been alive trying to kill me? If I hadn't done that. I was an English teacher once a long time ago. I later smoked more than an ounce a day and let it go. Now I'm trapped with all these crazies with a straight jacket, nothing more. Soon I'll be pushing daisies because they're banging at my duh. At my duh. Why did he, why did he, um, um, put the dots, put the periods, um, can we talk about that? You know, there's a lot of things that we should talk about in this game. Like, uh, explosives. When are they acceptable? Um, for commercial use, of course. Or not commercial use, but personal use. Um, you know, why would you write out your death like that? And what does this switch do? Messing with the electricity. Let's pull out a gun. I've got a gun! Puppet Man? Ah, uh, lovely. Isn't his name Donkey Kong? Can we talk about this? Haha! -ha. Oh. Okay. Anybody in here? 
Now there's a server in here, though. Ooh, hi. Hey, power's back on. Uh, new prototype, 10 times better than the previous one. Still a lot of work. 15 minutes in the virtual memory. Started to show symptoms of cyber sickness. Disoriented and horrified. And 20 minutes into the experiment, he started uncontrollably vomiting. So I had to abort the whole thing. At least he survived. I'm exhausted, but no time for rest. I'm too close to stop working now. Romeo! And that's why you don't leave me with just, uh, initials. What. The fuck. Okay. Let's try this again. What do we have back there? Oh. Nothing. Okay. Back through here. Like I said, Mr. Black, all oh. actions have consequences. You set a lunatic on the loose and just look what happened. Poor Mr. Keating died because of your decisions. Yeah, I know. I know. It was all my fault. Match found. John Keating. A tea trip reported missing in 2011. Hey, can we switch to my gun now? Thank you. And flip the switch. Something Back this way. I will make it to the party. After I turn the power back on. Just so I have that note. Whatever it may be. And... Much better. I feel so much better about that. And you know what, big guy? Because you're dead now? Screw the Puppet Master. Yeah. Yeah, fight the power. Uh, 15. Oh, Grace, girl, Robert Ramsey. Uh, Lenore Ramsey, formerly Thomas? Wait, what? Oh, Lenore Thomas. I was going to say Thomas Ramsey and Robert Ramsey. I mean, the the equipment doesn't fit, <laughs> especially for making children. Um, <laughs> L. Ramsey, uh, when registered, 22nd, February 1993. All right. Uh, cool. I need to fix this. I will not accept what happened to my daughter. Nor will I live with a wife who holds me responsible. Yeah! I will find whoever did this. So Lenore will see the truth. So she will forgive me. And so things can go back to the way they were before all this. Agreed. Do it. Are you... are you Donkey Kong? I want to know is where I'm supposed to go after I've gone through here. Probably just supposed to go back down. Ah! Oh. And now go back in here. Okay, you're still dead. Good. I'd be worried if you weren't. This way, wasn't it? There it is. Freaking parties. Uh, hello, Rob. Is everything okay? You're not picking up the phone, and we're all worried sick. Your team is amazing, and I know they're working night and day, but we clearly need your guidance in order to have this device ready to hit the market and become the success it deserves to be. 
We need to minimize all the symptoms of VR sickness testers are getting and fix the major bugs prior to release. Please communicate with us. We can't do this without you. Oh, that's sweet. They need him. Explosion near Bart Green. It must have been with one of those uh, authorized personal use explosives. On the scene when it happened, why was he there? Cole Black. Jasper Prado murdered just hours before the explosion. Was he involved? Jared Porter. Uh, questioned by police in Prado's case. What does he know? Roger Howard. Surely wouldn't stoop so low. We'll need hard evidence before moving against him. Fair enough. Cole Black was investigating Grace Ramsey's kidnapping. Claims he tried to solve this thing on his own but failed, or perhaps wanted to fail. History of addiction to prescription opiates would often lose grip of reality. Claims he has no memory of investigating Jasper, Jasper Prado and Rose Atkins. Can't recall that he knew the people directly involved in the kidnapping. To what extent should he be trusted? Fully! Because that's me. You gotta get me out of here, mate. They started talking behind my back. I can hear them. I think they know. Fuck, if that's true, I'm done. Get me a transfer to a different prison or, or bail me out or... I don't know, you're the fucking counselor, aren't you? If I don't get out, I'm dead. Oh no. That's why does this game have to randomly get creepy? How did you not know? All the light were there. How did you not realize? You did this, didn't you? Yes. It's my guess. Oh hey, we're in one of the sweet memories again. I hope this is still as sweet as the last one. I've changed her four times in the last three hours. She will not stop. Please can you take her? I need to lie down for a moment. Well, sure, but I thought we agreed to do this together. I just need to lie down. Ah. So what do we have here? Baby clothes! Remember folks, it does get better when having a kid. Friggin' like, the, all that diaper changing and shit, like, it is a pain in the ass. Sometimes they'll fucking cry and cry and cry and it drives you insane. But trust me, it does get better. Uh, is this game a thriller, a horror, a horror thriller, or a thrower? <laughs> I'm gonna go with thrower. <laughs> it's a... <laughs> a thrower game? Yes. It's a thor game! Robert Ramsey, Master of Science. See, and it keeps coming back to, like, this family's memory, so... Thirteen children and a teacher died in an accident. Uh, orb accident on the M40 motorway near Warwick. It was just after midnight when a minibus crashed into uh, a maintenance vehicle. Okay, so so that right there must be the maintenance vehicle, and they're just not showing the bus on this. Um, Eleanor Gray, 35, was the teacher who was driving the bus, transporting 15 children home from Worcestershire for, or from a school trip to London. She fell asleep at the wheel before the minibus struck a 12.5-ton Bedford motorway maintenance lorry and later exploded. So, wait, did she explode or did the bus explode? Details. Get them right. I, I am 100% sure that it was actually uh, Eleanor Gray that was the one that exploded.
The baby monitor. Is there anything else in here? She's hungry. Can you bring me her bottle, love? I think it's in the kitchen. I've got a PhD in neuroscience. I think I can manage it. I'm Probably not. Be like that. Oh, that was it? Okay. Uh, oh, we've got a couple memories to go to. Wait, can we go to... Oh. Well, let's go over here first. Yeah. And he's still got his heavy breathing going on. L Lenore and I were wondering if you wanted... What? It's me. Your son. Uh, calm down, Mum. It's fine. Everything's fine. Yes, that's right. Are you okay? <sighs> right. Um, no, no. No, it's fine. It's fine. So, Lenore and I were wondering... Nothing? You were wondering nothing. Okay. Fantastic. <laughs> uh, baby bottle and a document, maybe, that I can read? Scientific Englishman. Fear. And a knife. And what is that supposed to be? Is that supposed to be garlic? Are they breaking open some garlic? What the fuck is that? Got some jam. Seriously, who who sets up like several cutting boards and just has it like on two separate sides? I guess I guess if it's the family cooking together. Okay. We're gonna assume it's the family cooking together. Slept like a baby, clearly never had one. Oh look, she's trying to talk to you. Adult brains, I understand. But this this is just incessant, incoherent garbling. What on earth is she doing? Wow, what a douche. Uh. Oh, shit. Hi. Wow, okay. Can I go that way? Okay. I want, I want to go this way. I feel like that's something I can miss if I don't get that way now. <laughs> uh, okay, fine. Fine, we'll, we'll just assume that it's taking me the right way. Hi, clock. Interesting. No, but I want to go the other. I want to go. I want to go that way. Can I mess with you? Did you walk into a clock? Yes, I did. Whoa. Nifty. Ooh, and there's something over there too. Or is that where I came from? I think that's where I came from. I am so confused. A uh, puppy. A baby. Doll. Baby doll puppy. Hi there. Can we talk about this? What am I looking for? Hello. So the doctor said oh. Mum can't distinguish between the past and the present. It's all jumbled together somehow. How can a person forget so Ooh. much? Why can't they help her remember? I don't know. I guess we should probably go back. Oh, I get it. We need you for a moment. Oh, what I wouldn't give for one second alone with my thoughts. One goddamn second. Who needs time with their own thoughts? Whoa, what the... Can we talk about this? Okay. Do we need to go back? Huh. What was that? Guys, yeah, give me one second. I think I had a knock at the door.
We don't have to worry about it. It was just weeping. Oh, you're streaming. Yeah. Hi, everyone. Weeping says hello. And bye, everyone. And bye, everyone. <laughs> Alrighty. Uh, the, where am I supposed to go? I don't know where I'm supposed to go. Uh, maybe I have to click on the clock. Maybe there's something to click on the clock? Let me click my clock! Do I do? Ah, what do I do? Oh, hey! Oh, these turn! At least that one did. Can I hit all of them? Yes, I can! Interesting. Okay. So this is where I wanted to go anyways. See, now that it gave me a choice, this is probably going to get all jumbled. One moment she wanted to know why I wasn't in school. The next she was crying and complaining about her son, who never comes to visit. You were there every day. Whether she remembered or not, you were there for her. How can a person just forget? I should have helped her remember somehow. I should have found a way. You did everything you could. Oh. She loved you. Mom much. forgot everything. Remember that at least. Shitty day. Mom, why is Daddy so sad? He's worried about your gran, my love. He's just worried, that's all. It's it's all good. It's fine. There we go. This is really weird. This is getting intense. Rose Atkins. I really don't see why you hired this one. She doesn't ever seem to know where you are. She won't put you on the phone. She's a good assistant, Lenore. Rose Atkins. Give her time. I'm sure Wasn't that the person I was trying to track down? Keep an eye on her, will you? I don't trust her. Yeah. And nobody should. I don't know why, though. Grace said you promised to help with her science homework. Oh, shit. I'm, I'm just... C can you help her tonight? Do you mind? Fine. I've got this presentation first thing in the morning. I really feel like I'm on the verge of something here. This would mean so much for us, for the family. You understand, don't you? Okay. Can I hit that one? Nope, just this one. This is weird being on a clock. I'm on the clock. Get it? <laughs> uh, When's Dad coming home? Never. God knows, my love. Maybe we should ask Rose Atkins when he'll be home. Maybe she'll even set up an appointment for us. You don't Ooh, like her. Jaded. I don't trust her. You don't trust her? Or you don't trust Dad? Dun, dun, dun. Yeah, I'm punny. <laughs> okay, well, that went away. Brother, listen. I don't. You have this Grace, Rose. and because of that, you have Lenore. But you also have me. And I'm not going anywhere. It won't be long before Grace is old enough to leave home. Until then, there's you, and me, and the work. For now, that's all that matters. I love you. Kill Rose. So that's it then, huh? All right. So, he was having an affair. Fun. <laughs> no. Honestly, uh, cheaters are absolutely fucking deplorable. Those memories, could I use? Who those memories belong to is entirely irrelevant. They do not contain the answers That's we're looking for. Trust me. Now is not the time to start thinking, Black. Nobody cares about whatever theories you may have dreamed up in that little brain of yours. 
Now is the time to do as I say. Now is the time to proceed. Fuck you. Yeah. Waste around. Yay. I love a good waste of ground. Hello. Hey, can we? Make sense of this mansion Rose's text referred to. Dude. I believe she meant Bertarelli Hall. Ring any bells? Should they? The Pandora will let us know either way. I've left a photo out especially. Focus on it and let's see what happens. Tomorrow's the day. We're just trying up loose ends. Tying up loose ends now. Uh, we spoke about maybe having to cut our colleague, colleague out of the picture, if you get my meaning. Hope you're fine with that. We'll get the job done regardless. Juliet! Seems right. Uh, someone's singing, so be extremely cautious. I'm going to track this guy down, but for now we have to keep our eyes open. We don't need any unnecessary attention. Oop. Oop. There we are. We need a current high-res satellite photo of his house. Take care of it ASAP. Wait, what was the, uh, who was that address with? Rose, uh, roses are red to needle in the hay. Okay. Do you like the new safe house? Yes, I love it. Cozy little place, isn't it? It's great. Perfect for the task. Yes. I'm sure our mutual friend would approve. They would approve. Anyway, make yourself at home, begin your preparations. If you need anything, you let me know personally and I will take care of it. You have three weeks and no excuses. Don't disappoint me. What if I can get it done in two weeks with one excuse? Huh? Huh? Compromise. Eric, is that you? The name's Patrick. <laughs> I was out with Rose. I tell you, that girl is one fucking surprise after another. Who would have thought a girl like that would know how to party? She's pretty messed up, though, man. Yeah. You know all that stuff we were joking about before? Yeah. Yeah, that. I'm serious. All right, what do we got? That's the memory I'm supposed to dive into, apparently. And what was Jasper Prado doing in that building just a couple of days before Grace's kidnapping? And why did someone report a group of armed mercenaries using a nearby area for target practice? Was it some kind of hideout? Yes. Where the fuck are you, Jasper? <gasps> Eric just called me. Jasper, run! I've heard from you since yesterday. If I find out you're on another bender the day before the job, so help me, God. Do you have any idea how important tomorrow is? No. I need you on your A game. Maybe Jasper. you could say a little bit more and explain everything. So if Eric tells me they found you sucking on a hash pipe again, I will chop your balls off with a pair of rusty fucking hedge clippers. That'll get the job done, but it's gonna hurt. Uh, so you want 295 euros for exactly the same BFG 66 double wall mic that you had listed at 235 euros last month. Fuck you, pal. I'll give you 250, including delivery deal. Wait, wait, what? The, you're still going up on that listing of last month plus delivery charges. See, and you started with fuck you, pal. You were going on so strong. Okay, we're ready to go. Try not to fuck this up. What do you take me for? A nihilistic psycho who wants to show off. Are you for real? I'm a pro. Me and my boys, we've been in a fucking war together. We do this quick and clean. Just tell your boys this time nobody gets killed or even wounded. No, oh, I already read that one. Alrighty. Diving in. Going into the animus. How deeply intriguing, Mr. Black. It seems you do have some memory of this place. Which means what, exactly? I wouldn't want to speculate at this point. I'm sure the implications will become clear. So, what am I looking for here? Rose? Jasper? Perhaps even both? Let's just see what we can find out, shall we? Yeah! Don't you worry, I'll find out. 
Do I have my cool gun? Yay! I've got the cool gun. I just wanted to make sure. Okay. It's really weird. Fingerprints identified. Rose Atkins and Jasper Prado. Huh. Okay. Well, I guess I figured out that door. Their inside man. But I never knew he was. Oh, gorgeous. How you doing, sweetheart? I'm Jasper, and I'm very pleased to meet you. You can cut the flattery, Mr. Prado. I know who you are. Our employer has filled me in. Filled you in, lucky bastard. I'm sorry. No. Ah, ah, ah. I get it. You're a professional type. I, I suppose you want to see the setup. Cross the eyes, dot the T's. All that shit. Yes, Mr. Prado. Please, show me around. So she's the real killer. That's a start. Get as much information as you can, Mr. Black. Be meticulous. Understood. Oh. Guys. There's nobody here. There's nobody here. Nothing cool. Alright, fantastic. Oh! Shit. That was not what I meant to do. <laughs> Yeah, you need to stop drinking. Drinking bad. Ha ha ha. I put a box in the way. Uh, okay. So... I'm gonna wait a second because I don't want him turning this way and then looking like a jackass. Although it really sucks to have someone behind me. Wait, what? What am I what am I supposed to be seeing here? Oh! Nifty! Can I go behind this? Yes, I can. Is that still behind a box? Yes. Ooh. Okay. Uh, he's gonna look this way. Got it. And he doesn't look this way anymore. Oh, wait. So, do I have to go back this way? I'm confused. Look that way more. Oh, that'll work. That'll work just fine. Yay! Turn back the other way, please. No. Ah, damn it. I was almost through. What do we have here? I'm terrified by this group. In wait. <clears throat> I'm terrified by this group in aptitude. It's time to get this thing done. I'm sick and tired of pretending that Ramsey actually matters to me anymore. Rose. Uh, we needed some time to get this whole family under surveillance, but it's done now, so calm the fuck down, Stefan. Who's Stefan? I will not pronounce that a Stephen. PH makes a goddamn F sound. Uh, safe house home plan. Interesting. Fair enough. That looks like a main way to go. Let's run this way. Oh. Hi. And yeah. Yeah. Oh. Yes. Yes. No. Yes. Your current location matches coordinates from which FDG servers were remotely accessed. Check servers. Be an open term Check CCTV. Nearby. This could give you the information we're looking for. Can we turn it off at any given moment? Yes, we can. Kill Jasper for breaking my access card. With pleasure. 
Huh. Okay. The key card should be close by. Yeah, it's right here. Okay. I guess maybe it's the other way. Neutralize. Well, the less I know about that, the better, I suppose. As long as it doesn't change anything. This changes everything. Trust you, Atkins. That would seem to be the case, yes. Keep me updated. And let me know the second she arrives at the safe house. I won't. All right. Let's go through here and get... Computer. No. Plan. Two cars, 78 men, 40 minutes of work on the spot. The second car arrives at 9.30 p.m. The driver waits. And three armed... Wait. Okay. One. Wait. Oh, okay. There's three and four. Okay, one. The first car arrives at 9 p.m. sharp and parks in the area 50 to 100 meters from the... R's house, Romeo. Uh, the second car arrives at 9.30 p.m. Driver awaits and three armed guys enter the building, pick up the package, and put it on the back seat. Uh, guys in the second car get approximately 68, 6 to 8 minutes to pick up the package, package and get the fuck out of there. Deadly serious. <laughs> I'm super serial, you guys. You need to be fast. Uh... Fast, furious, but also quiet as fuck. The crew in the first car is going to get everything fixed up before the second car arrives, turning off the CCTV in the whole area, taking care of the security cameras installed on the roof of Romeo's house, taking control over the traffic lights at the nearest junction. At 9.40 p.m., both cars drive to the pickup point, but take different routes, 10.15 p.m., meeting at the pickup point. Fair enough. So they had a job. Mm -hmm. uh, Jay's right hand, Jay's left hand. Pick up R from his car and lead him to the exchange point. Brain of this mission, the main pick up. Wait. The main pick up the ransom and give back the girl artist. Keeps watch over the girl and make sure everything goes smoothly. Wait, wait, wait. Who is C? Huh. Okay. Guess that was the partner they had to cut out, probably. Form Ramsey, we got our demands. Schedule meeting. J and E take the data from him, then lead Ramsey underground. Waits with the girl. Later watches over the exchange. After the exchange, J leads Ramsey and the girl back to the car. E, M, and T? Okay. Clean the place up. Fair enough. Uh, first car driver, IT specialist, hacking artist, M's right hand, the wire artist. Try not to fall asleep this time, you stupid motherfucker. His role is yet to be determined. Brand the mission, pick up the package, second car driver, S's right hand. There is so much in this game. Like, uh, an exuberant amount of detail was put into this game, and I think that's another re he 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 really uh, another reason I really like this game. So yeah, I guess you don't know how to use it. So a uh, so I just set it on the third slot for everyone. Try not to change anything. Don't mess with the frequency because if you fuck it up and start transmitting on. 406 megahertz, we're all screwed. I'll take that, thank you. Oh, shit. Oh, that, no. Now give it back. I'll need that. Uh, I've already, I already had that one, didn't I? Uh, school. Oh, 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 that's the daughter. Got it. And that must be the wife. Yep, there's the wife. Oh, 
These are explanations of their day. Oh, okay. She works at an art gallery. Texting, chatting with Rose, telling his wife it's work. Ha ha. Oh, that's messed up. Oh. Okay, I've got a lot of work on today. I'll be back at 10, maybe later. Lenora, sure, would uh, do what you want. Lenora, don't be like that. I'm not being like anything, Robert. Do what you want. You know how important this work is, don't you? Dinner is in the fridge. I'll see you later. What the fuck? Her name's Lenore? Fancy old tart, ain't she? Who the fuck is called Lenore? <laughs> Jeez. Uh, okay. So, here's an issue I am having. So, we checked out all that stuff. Um... But we didn't get this key card, apparently. Oh wait, was there something back there? It's over here. Back this way. Wait. Back this way? Really? How far back? Where the hell are we looking? Ah, okay. Oop! Let's just assume I pressed the wrong button. <laughs> that radio is fucked. Whoops. Thomas Hale. Ah. Good thing guns don't have a mouse click. Oh. God damn it. <laughs> Why do I keep assuming it's friggin' just click the button? I think it's because the phone is in front of me, so it seems like that should be the damn button. Social security ID. Fingerprints identified. Rose Atkins. Okay. When we contact Randall, we say give us the memory gizmo or your girl gets it. That's it. That's it. And how did they not hear the gunshots no. from upstairs? You said he don't much care for his family. What if he just He won't. Is that it? Ah. Okay. Shit. I'm still missing some data. Well, what the fuck are you missing now? Okay. Then it's obviously gonna be downstairs, right? But downstairs is one of those other guys. Oh, wait. There's an upstairs. Let's go upstairs, or... Er... Ah, oh, nifty. Oh. Oh. Stop messing about, return to your post. I'm not here. Why are you not firing? <laughs> Thank you. Jesus. It uh, it refused to uh, pull the trigger. Of course, I can mistakenly fire the trigger several times, but actually firing the trigger? Nah. Where are you going? Fantastic. That's uh that's much better. Alright. So there's obviously something over here, so yeah. Wait, why is there a box there? Probably some sneaking I could have done. So I probably shouldn't have put that in my way. 
Rose's property, still waiting for a man brave enough to deliver it to her. The, the pizza? The iPad thing. Part of her badge. Yay! So I did go the right way. I think the best man for the job. In and out, so we know that it's done. Once you got her, you can sit tight until the pen arrives. I'm not so sure if it will be this simple. Ah. It's paranoid. There's multiple alarm systems, CCTV. Listen, darling, it's a kidnapping, not rocket surgery. To be honest, I've lost count of how many snatches I've done. All you need to worry your pretty little head about is that the info you've given us is legit. You get me? I assure you my info is legit, Mr. Prado. It's what you're going to do with it that worries me. Woo! Well, okay then. Woo, what do we have here? A safe! Hi, Jared. This is Ben. Surprise, surprise. Shit, Hi, Ben. I wish I could see your face right now, mate. Listen, we all know what you did, you backstabbing son of a bitch. Did I, though? And I thought we were friends. <laughs> Interesting. Alrighty, back down here, and then over this way. And... Now, let's log in. Okay, let's try this out. ID works. Yay! What now? Was was that it? It's right not to trust her. How could you trust her? You are not a victim. You set this all in motion. Oh, Grace, you're, you're crazy. Uh, I read the short story you sent, or I read the short story you sent me on Wednesday, Zombie Teachers vs. Vampire Kids. Funny shit, Grace. I'm your number one fan. Now we can uh, get drunk and have another movie marathon day. Cool. That's exactly what we all need. Get drunk and have movie marathons. Uh, can hypnosis be useful during interrogation? For more than 50 years, hypnosis, blah de blah de blah Bluebird, Artichoke, and McCultra? Okay, uh, Morris Island works off of security, not only employed, academic expert... Wait... Not only employed academic experts on the subject of hypnosis, uh, Alan hypnotized secretaries from his office to steal classified files and pass them on to strangers. In one case, he allegedly convinced one of them to take a pistol she believed was loaded uh, and shoot her colleague, but later experiments proved that these techniques can be highly unreliable and far more effective if the subject has a positive relationship with the hypnotist. Without a pre-existing relationship, it was almost impossible to rely on these techniques, and an interrogation setting would immediately cause the subject to resist hypnotic induction. Huh. Fair enough. Hey, Hannah, it's Grace. Uh, I'm only home for another few days now, so let's arrange something soon. Oh, and uh, make sure you check out that link I sent you. You'll love it. Anyway, um, call me back. Bye. Cool. Way to go, Grace. And there's the cat. The cat is back. The cat from the first memory. I mean, I guess it would only go away, like, if they maybe ate the cat or something. Which, you never knew. So every now and again, people are like, I want Chinese. And everybody else is like, yeah, me too. Oh. What the fuck? 
Uh, I guess go to the room? What's going on here? Uh, uh, confusion? Uh, where am I supposed to be going? these people. Huh. Yeah, beat the crap out of him. Kick him in the balls. It always works. Always. Where are we now? Oh no, we're back in here. Shit. That must have been when, uh, when it exploded. And... Okay. This place is all fucked up. Cool. Where were you? What happened? Are you okay? Where's Grace? Where were you? At work, you know that. Where's Grace? You Is... weren't at work. I called you at work. I called you on your mobile. I even called Rose. Huh. Nobody answered. Lenore, where is she? Where's Grace? Lenore! She's gone, Robert! She's gone! Uh-oh. Uh, we kind of already knew. This is strange. Wherever she is, I'll find her. I promise. You did this, didn't you? What? How could you even say that? Your obsessions, Robert. With work, with your technology, with Rose. It's all led us here. With Rose? Lenore, I have don't. no... Just... Don't. Interesting. Where's the phone? Oh. Hello? Sorry to call you here. <laughs> you weren't answering your mobile. I can't talk right now. I'll speak to you later. Is everything okay? She's gone. Who's gone? Lenore? I have to go. And her at Man, this game is so trippy. I am so confused right now. It all comes back to this original kidnapping. That much I do know. I understand now. That girl, Grace. That was the girl from the explosion. The girl with the bomb was Grace Ramsey. Yes, Mr. Black. The girl you failed to save. And you knew. You put me through all of this to find information that you could have just told me. Or was that not part of my fucking treatment? Hmm. Oh. Sorry to call you in the middle of your mind fucked, mind no, screwed. Mr. Black, I couldn't tell you. I dream you inside of the memory behind a thought. Who yes. She was. <laughs> I needed you to say her name. I'm sorry. Sorry, Mr. Black. For Grace, she was taken, kidnapped, held to ransom for Ramsey's memory oh, tech. It's your place. memory tech. It's you, isn't it? You're Robert Ramsey. Yes, I'm Robert Ramsey. And Grace, my Grace, was abducted for a ransom demand I never received. Oh, look, I don't know what to say, Robert. I'm just so, so... Save your pity. Save your emotions. I do not need them. 
All I need to know is who Rose and Jasper were working for. Who was behind it, Mr. Black? I don't know. But isn't it obvious? If I had to make a guess... Then you would be making assumptions. We deal with facts here, Mr. Black. Hard evidence. Empirical data. Oh. I have my suspicions, yes. But we have come so too far not to throw it all away on guesswork. Got it. We must continue with your treatment. Treatment? There never was any treatment, though, was there? I'm not here through choice, am I? Although your memory is damaged, I see your intuition is not. No, Mr. Black, this is not a hospital, but a prison. And unless you proceed, you will find me to be a less than hospitable warden. I am your lock. I am your key. I can be your enemy or I can be your salvation, but I will have my answers. Now, proceed. Well, all right then. But you know what? I am going to go ahead and leave this as uh, our little cliffhanger. Um, I don't know if there's a certain button on how I save, because I can't remember, but I will figure that out after I go ahead and end the stream. But thank you, everybody, for joining me. Thank you, Ash, for all those bits you gave. That was terribly wonderful. I like You like that little oxymoron right there? Yeah. But uh, <clears throat> Donald is... Always, thank you so much for popping in. It's always a uh, joy to have you here and have some fun little quips to throw my way. Unicorn R2 unit, thank you so much for being here. And again, congratulations on that amazing little boy of yours. Um, can't wait to meet him. Um, with that said, we are going to be doing Final Fridays tomorrow night at uh, 10 p.m. Per, uh, per the usual. That's Mountain Standard Time for anybody you, anybody who is not in the same time zone. And, uh, yeah. I'm pretty much going to call it a day, and I think I'm going to get some pizza. But, uh, many of you I will see in the next one. If I don't, have a wonderful, wonderful week and a wonderful weekend. And let's see here. If it'll let me get over here, it will. Fantastic. So, everybody have a wonderful day. Anybody over on YouTube, be sure to like and subscribe, as it really does help me out. And uh, be sure to throw some comments down below. Tell me what you think. Excuse me there. Freaking Mountain Dew gets me every time. All right. Later, folks.